Okay, how's everybody doing this evening? Yes, my name is Kent and the channel is EOS San Diego and I make videos about the blockchain. Primarily the EOS blockchain. So, um, we are block producers. We are also application builders. Uh, the, the, the latest version of the challenge application is very, very close to being finished. And of course, we're gonna have it up there as soon as possible. So please, uh, Join our Telegram channel if you want to know exactly the updates of what's going on. But we're getting close. Like I said, we have the smart contracts done. We are working on the Android version. And of course, when we get the applications hooked to both Android and Apple, we will release it with a few graphics and we will be up and running. And, and really what's going on with the applications right now on the blockchain is there hasn't been that one application that has really taken off. Nothing's taken off on the Ethereum blockchain nor the EOS blockchain. Nothing has really taken off. And the reason why is because we're so early in blockchain technology, just like the internet. On the internet, the first you know things to go to go well on the internet was pornography and gambling, which is exactly what's going on with EOS. I noticed that hash, hash babies is one of the most active uh, transactions on the blockchain right now, and bet dice. I mean, these are the gambling and pornography, it's exactly like the internet. So we are mirroring early days internet with the blockchain by having applications that are pornography and gambling. But it will mature into more applications, applications that will do a lot, lot more. And I think the, the challenge application is something now that is the next level. I mean, we're not, we're not, we're not doing the, something that's uh, putting real estate all on the internet or doing something on a blockchain or taking every, everybody's uh, DNA, put it on a blockchain. We're not putting those, we're not doing those big things yet. We're doing the smaller things. Uh, and, and of course, the uh, challenge is a geolocation way of finding where somebody's at, finding out where somebody's at, challenging them to do something and then have them meet that challenge on the blockchain and then be able to get a reward for it through a smart contract. So that's something a little bit more advanced. And of course, the more advanced, the more advanced, the more advanced. And eventually everything will be running on the blockchain, but we're just making that gradual transition from, from, from the world of internet to the world of blockchain. So that's what's going on right now. Also, I want to talk a little bit about a lot of people are really a lot of people are really giving the blockchain a hard time. Donald Trump, for instance, is anti-blockchain. I noticed tonight I was watching Max Kaiser. Max Kaiser has been a big, big fan of Donald Trump. But after what Donald Trump said about the blockchain and about uh, uh, Bitcoin, he's no longer a fan. So anyway, Max finally wised up. Uh, but anyway, as he was talking a little bit about somebody was listening to, you know, when is Donald Trump? Trump the, the blockchain isn't for Donald Trump. Donald Trump doesn't need the blockchain. Neither does Warren Buffett. I mean, these guys, they're old white guys that have never been denied services or never been denied opportunities and need to, needed to, to, to access the system, the banking system or the financial system. These are white billionaires that have never ever had to struggle with anything as far as getting access to anything, including the financial system. So the, the blockchain isn't for them. The blockchain never will be for them. Blockchain is for people that need to access banking, people that need to access uh, information, um, uh, people that need to share information on the, on the internet, on a blockchain, on a distributed database. That's who this is for. This isn't for senators and congressmen that are doing well, that don't ever need to worry about, you know, setting up a bank account, transferring money to somebody else, maybe in another country, family member that you're trying to get money to, uh, somebody that you're trying to pay in another country for work that they've done. They don't never had to worry about that. They don't need to worry about that. They've got other people doing it for them. So they don't need the access to this system. So this is why they're anti-blockchain and they don't really understand or ever will. So people should just ignore their ideas and their activities because they're amount to zero when it comes to who really needs this and what's really going on. So anyway, the applications are getting better and better. They will be getting much better. I hope the challenge application is a huge addition to the EOS blockchain and uh, we'll see some more being built here very soon. Some, some stuff that I think will be very, very much, very active, used very much, used a lot. So anyway, uh, watch for more applications being built because there's going to be a lot more released here very, very soon. I appreciate you watching. Thank you.